During World War II, one wild idea almost turned ice into armor. It was called Pycrete, a composite made of ice and wood pulp, roughly 86% water and 14% fiber. When frozen, it became astonishingly strong, resistant to bullets, slow to melt, and far tougher than plain ice. The concept came from Jeffrey Pike, whose dream was to build a colossal, floating aircraft carrier made entirely of this frozen mixture. The British called it Project Habakkuk, and small prototypes were actually built and tested in Canada. Engineers found that Pycrete didn't shatter like ice, it splintered almost like wood, a bizarre hybrid of the natural and the man-made. But despite its promise, the project sank under its own weight. Maintaining refrigeration, logistics, and scale proved impossible as war strategies evolved. A fleeting dream of frozen steel, proof that imagination can outlast the ice.